Welcome to Always Dolls and thanks for joining us. Today we are crafting more items from Girl of the Year 2022 Corinne Tan's Ski and Snack Shop. See how to make yummy choc chip granola bars and delicious fruit smoothies. If you enjoy this video, we'd love it if you hit the like button, subscribe and turn on the bell so you never miss a new DIY. Our dolls are hungry from skiing the slopes, so let's get making! Starting with the granola bars, cut three rectangles of cardboard that measure 4 by 3 centimeters. Stack and glue them together. For the oats, we are using actual breakfast cooking oats. We have used oats in the past for our DIY breakfast cereal with great success. Since the oats were saturated with liquid glue, they were sealed and therefore did not discolour or go mouldy. You can click the card top right to watch this video. Cover your cardboard generously with liquid glue. Using the end of your paintbrush as a pickup stick, place individual oats onto the bar. Keep going until you have covered the whole surface. Next, coat the sides with lots of liquid glue and dip the surface into your oats. Knock off any loose or misplaced oats, then place individual ones into any obvious gaps. Set the piece aside to dry completely. You may need to add more oats later if you find it looking patchy. For the chalk chip detail, we used Reeves Burnt Sienna Paint. It's the perfect warm brown colour. Referencing an American Girl promo picture, we painted directly over the oats in the same key areas. Once dry, repeat on the back. Next, paint the sides, top and bottom the same colour. The granola bars look good enough to eat, but remember, they're just for your dolls. To make the label, cut two strips of hot pink paper and an oval of brown paper. Write the name in white gel pen. Place your pink paper face down onto clear packing tape and the second 3.5 centimeters below it. Place your granola bar in between as seen on screen. Cover the back of the bar with more packing tape, making sure your pieces of tape are wider and longer than the actual size of the granola bar. Seal the bag by pinching the tape together, getting as close as you can to the sides, top and bottom of the granola bar. Cut away any excess packing tape. Now your dolls have both a delicious and nutritious snack that can be eaten on the go. Ok, let's move on to making the smoothies. We are going to use this 4 pack of mini message bottles bought from Kmart. You can use them as is, however we want our bottle to be a little taller and rounder at the top. Carefully cut away the mouth section and remove the bottom centimetre. From a second bottle, cut off the lower 2.5 centimetres and join it to your original one. But before doing this, we need to paint the inside. Mix Mod Podge with pink paint for the strawberry flavour. Dab the mixture onto the plastic to avoid a streaky application, allowing the first layer to dry before coming back with another. Next, glue the two pieces of bottle together with sticky tape. We can hide the seam with a label. We made ours using MS Word. Go to your toolbar and click the Insert tab. From here, select a simple text box. Under the Format option, change the fill colour to a light pink and select the No Outline option. Type in your text, then go to the Home tab to centre the text and change the colour and font to be similar to the American Girl version. Repeat these steps to make a second purple text box underneath. Next, we want to insert shapes. The AG label features triangles which are part of Corinne's mountain motif theme. Again, you will need to change the colour and remove the outline. Copy and paste your triangles to fill the length of the label. Use the same steps to add red star shapes on either side of the text. Print, cut out and glue your label to the bottle. Next, hot glue a pink button over the opening for the cap. To mimic the fruit pieces seen in AG smoothies, draw dots and dashes onto the bottle with a pink permanent marker. Repeat all the steps above to make an orange version for the mango banana smoothie. Thanks for spending your time with us today as we make more food items from Corinne Tan's collection. You can find links to our DIY nachos and hot cocoa crafts in the description box. See you soon for more miniature crafting fun!